So this is my apartment when you first walk in. Um, I actually decided to downgrade. So I no longer have a two bedroom, I now have a one bedroom. But this is what my, my place looks like. It's very, very simple. I have a walk-in closet. I have like a coat closet and I have started like already moving stuff in. So you are gonna see some of my clothes, but I have a closet right here, which is pretty cool. This is gonna be really, really quick. And then of course, this is my living area. I plan to have my TV over here and my couch over there. And I'm just gonna figure out what to do with the rest of the space and everything else that I have. This is my kitchen. The appliances aren't that great. I kind of wish the appliances matched with the vibe of the actual apartment, because this is a luxury apartment. I think the appliances should match, but you know, it is what it is and you get what you get, I guess. So over here I have a little pantry closet that I really like. So all my food is gonna go in here. I have this really wide thing going on over here with the granite countertops, which I really like. <coughs> if you guys watched my last apartment tour, this is very much like my last apartment but it's not the same apartment. Over here, obviously I have my, you know, just regular stuff, my appliances, microwave. Um, the closets are pretty handy and I'm very sure I can reach the top. Yep. And my apartment did smell like smoke when I got it. Um, I think the people who were here before me smoked cigarettes, so I had to leave the windows open just because I did not like that smell. <coughs> Of course, I have these stools over here. They did not come with the apartment. I got these myself. And then over here is my balcony. And then I have this empty space. It's supposed to be like a dining area, but I'm gonna use this kind of like a workspace for myself. So probably gonna have my sewing table over here and then I'm just gonna have something over there. Um, I haven't figured out exactly what I wanna do with it yet, but we're gonna figure something out. But that's this area and I really like it. And this is my balcony which is really big. I actually plan on doing um, sort of like a mini backyard out here with fake grass and all that, but that's gonna come a little bit later once I know I'm ready to invest like in staying at this apartment. So in my bathroom, which I look a hot mess, so we not gonna look at me today. <laughs> I also have another one of these closets. Um, Looks like that. I really like the structure of it and how you know sturdy it looks and all. I kind of miss my last apartment because that one was really nice. But so over here is my bathroom. Nothing spectacular, just bathroom, tub, sink, with some storage underneath. And then this time I have a little thing at the side to put my toiletries in. And then this apartment, of course, I have my washer and dryer, and I also have a little bit of storage space over there, which I really like, as well as storage above. So there's a lot more storage space than my last apartment, but my last apartment, actually, that's a lie. I have a lot of storage space in my last apartment. Oh, well. And then, of course, because I have a one bedroom, there's nothing much to show you guys. So this is what my bedroom looks like. And in this apartment, I actually have a balcony in my bedroom. So I have a balcony in my bedroom, which is pretty cool. Has a door and everything. I think only one of these doors opens. But I really like that. I just feel like it's gonna get cold during the winter because obviously there's a door here now, but we'll figure it out. And then this is my closet. I actually have a rather large closet in this space. Um, of course, in my last space, I had two closets. Actually, guys, let me tell you the truth. This is the second time I'm moving since my last video. Um, I actually used to live in an apartment that looks exactly like this, but it just didn't have a balcony in the bedroom. And I wasn't sure if I was going to stay, so I never filmed a, a, like a moving thing for that one. So this is what my closet looks like. It's pretty large. I have two rows of shelving. Um, I've already started moving some of my stuff. I actually lived in the exact same unit below, so I don't actually have to pack. I just have to move my stuff directly upstairs. Um, and, you know, just closet space. My closet is pretty big. Um, I think they told me that I can fit a full-size bed in here. And that's just right here, not including this little storage space over here. Um, so that's pretty cool as well. But yeah, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much it for this uh, 
this empty apartment tour. Um, I would, w once I finish furnishing, obviously, because I already have everything directly below me. Once I finish moving everything and um, I show you guys everything, I'm going to show, as soon as I finish moving everything, I'm going to show you guys what the apartment looks like fully furnished. So, of course, like I said before, I have this exact same unit downstairs. So, I already know where everything is going to be. I might change a little bit, uh, I might change some things up, but I'm not sure yet. But that's what we're looking at right now. So you say you wanna get away We don't need a plane I could be your escape